Hello, sports fans. Welcome to RVing with Luck. I'm Ralph Luck. My martial arts cat ninja and I have been living full time in my classy RV for two and a half years, 99% of the time boondocking. But today, <clears throat> I have a very unusual video, special announcement. I'm a Planet Fitness member, and I will shower at Planet Fitnesses around the country. It's a nice convenience. But recently, Planet Fitness, and I'm only going to try to tell the facts. I'm going to just try to tell the facts here, and then you... Leave your opinion. A woman at an Alaska Planet Fitness walked into the female locker room, saw a male shaving his face, and said, what are you doing in here? And he said something to the effect of, I'm gay, I'm LGBT, I'm trans, I identify as a woman, something along those lines. She said, you have a penis, you should not be in the woman's locker room. She looked over, saw an approximate 12-year-old girl in a towel, in a corner, afraid. Or appearing to be afraid. Allegedly. I don't know. And she told the male. You need to get out. Click. I'm taking your picture. She went to management. Management said. Our Planet Fitness rules are. Anyone can use the bathroom. That they feel. That they respond to. Or something like that. It's online in Section 5 on the uh, Planet Fitness Rules that says they can use the bathroom that they feel affiliated with. The next day, she found out that she had her membership canceled by Planet Fitness because of violation of taking a photo of somebody in the bathroom. And yes, that is a violation that can be a cancellation. But this lady's excuse was, I was taking a photo of a crime, a male with a penis in the female's bathroom. Planet Fitness said, that's allowed. You taking the photo is not allowed. You're canceled. So I ask you, what are your opinions? Can a man with a penis, because he feels like it, be in the woman's bathroom? Should a woman be canceled because she took a photo of this crime going on in the men's bathroom and with the Planet Fitness boycott going on, people canceling left and right, finding out that canceling your Planet Fitness subscription is a lot harder than you thought. Should somebody like me that counts on going to Planet Fitness several times a month just for the convenience of a shower, should I cancel my Planet Fitness membership? I mean, if I was on that side that said, yes, no male should be in the women's bathroom, blah, 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 should I cancel that and then have a more difficult or expensive time taking showers as a full-time RVer? Let me know. Be positive, be nice, be active.